السلام عليكم وعليكم السلام ورحمة الله وبركاته. How are you, dear friend? Yeah, I'm well and thanks for asking. And how are you? Yeah, Alhamdulillah, I'm doing well by the mercy of Almighty Allah. And thank you for inviting me uh, on your conversation. So okay. hope we can make a great conversation today. Okay, where are you from? And could you please give me your introduce? Yeah, thank you for asking. Yeah, so this is uh, Azam. Okay. And uh, somebody calls me Azam, somebody calls me uh, Prince, because Prince is my nickname. Okay. But my real name is Golam Azam. So if you call me Azam, then I may feel comfortable more. So uh, I'm from India, basically. And uh, currently, I'm a student. I am uh, doing law. You can say I'm doing graduation under law. And yeah. as well as I'm an English learner. So that's why I'm here with you today. So that's it, I think, uh, for the time being. Yeah. Okay. It's really amazing that you are from India. So could you please tell me which part of India do you, you know, are, are you from? Yeah, sure. I, I forgot to mention. Actually, I'm from West Bengal. So mm -hmm. that's why uh, my mother tongue is also Bengali. So okay. uh, and I know that your your mother tongue is also Bengali. So that's why uh, uh, whenever we talk to each other, we just feel more comfortable to express ourselves. So actually, mm -hmm. if I mention my district, so actually my district is located the north part of West Bengal. Okay. And my district's name is South Dinashpur. Okay. That's very really interesting to know. Uh, my full name is Jihadul Islam. And I live in Cox Bazar, which is really famous in, in you know, Bangladesh. And also it's really famous mm -hmm. for tourism because we have the world longest sea beach and people, they come here from different kinds of places, not even, uh, I mean, not even from Bangladesh, but also from different kinds of countries like India or, I mean, different kinds of countries. Okay. So that's why it's really famous, I can say. Mm -hmm. And I basically live in a small village, which is also really famous in my city. Mm -hmm. And the name of my village is Notuno Fish. And some people, they know uh, by Kutakali. So, okay, okay. so this is all about me. And nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you too. And thank you for explaining uh, your area's beauty, because I know I follow you on our Facebook. So whenever I just get your videos, I feel really uh, nice. Whenever I see, I look at the beauty of your own area. Because okay. you are from a famous place. And you already mentioned that uh, many uh, tourists, they just visit there. And I mm -hmm. want to mention that many Indian also, they just visit. Basically, if I say, because I live in West Bengal, so many Bengali people, they want to prefer go to Bangladesh. And okay. especially to Cox's Bazaar because Cox's Bazaar is very famous. And mm -hmm. CBS, you can understand uh, for tourism, CBS is really, you know, uh, you can say, uh, uh, you know, play a big role to mm -hmm. earn money, definitely, I can say. So that's why uh, I believe that uh, if I get uh, any chance in my life, inshallah, you can say I uh, will go to Bangladesh just for visiting purpose because I have many friends and you are also one of them, I can say. So okay. definitely, if I get any chance to visit Bangladesh, then I must try to visit Cox's Bazaar also. Okay, <laughs> and you are you are welcome to visit my city, Cox Bazaar, and which is really amazing what I said. So do you know why is it famous in Bangladesh? Uh, yeah, uh, actually Cox's Bazaar is uh, famous for the sea beast, and this is the longest, you, ha you have already mentioned, yeah. the longest sea beast in Asia, not only in Bangladesh and not only uh, in uh, the Indian content, it's uh, uh, it, it's uh, in you know it's the uh, famous and biggest uh, in the whole Asia, I think, as oh. far as my knowledge. Yeah. yeah but uh, so I have to mention that it's not really uh, only for mm -hmm. famous world longest sea beach, but we all we, I mean we have more things like we have a lot of mountains and also waterfalls, which Mountain. is located in in uh, I mean Himchori. And once time I went there for visiting that place and that place is really amazing. And it is called uh, Himsori. 
Okay, and in also Himsori. there, yeah, there is a forest which is also beautiful in Himsori, and for that it's really you know famous. And also we have a lot of rivers. I mean, big rivers. So for that it's really famous. So you are always uh, welcome to visit my country, to visit uh, also my city, which is Cox Bazar. Uh, okay, but especially if I talk about tourism, so what is what what, what is the favorite tourist place yeah, in I'm Europe? Going to mention. Yes. Okay. Yes. I'm going to mention that thing actually, because if I say what is the most uh, famous tourist place in the not part of West Bengal, then I have to mention Darjeeling. Okay. This okay, is a Darjeeling. beautiful place. Yeah, Darjeeling. But even I couldn't get chance to go there. Okay. Mm -hmm. But I watched many videos and that place is really amazing. So if anybody will go to Darjeeling or if anybody will visit there, then they okay. may uh, see the Kanchenjunga and other so many things. Okay. Wow. So this is a very uh, famous place. And uh, you told that uh, in in Iru, Iru, in Iru area, uh, mm. Actually, a lot of people just uh, come there for visiting purpose, not only from Bangladesh, but also from the other countries. So same here in mm -hmm. West Bengal, uh, actually Darjeeling, Darjeeling is a very famous place and many uh, Indian also come here and the foreigners also come here for visiting purpose. And Shilikuri, okay. Shilikuri is also one of the you know uh, good places, I can say. And if I say about the North Bengal, then you know very well our capital is, I mean, our state's capital is Kolkata. And Kolkata mm -hmm. is a historical city. So many, many foreigners also come here uh, just to uh, look at the city and just mm -hmm. for understand uh, the mindset of the Bengali people. Okay. And as well as Digha is one of the famous place. If anybody mm -hmm. wish to see the, uh, wish to uh, see the, you can see, see, then they may visit the Digha because Digha is very famous here. And this is one oh. of the uh, biggest tourist place in West Bengal right now. Okay. Mm -hmm. And if anybody is interested to visit the historical area, okay, then they may go to, uh, you know, uh, Murshidabad. You know that Murshidabad is famous place for the historical, uh, you can say, uh, uh, historical thing. Okay. <laughs> so many, uh, yeah, historical okay. places and, are located. And you know that uh, many times I also hear the name of Darjeeling. And, and also recently I have seen a lot of videos about Darjeeling, like people are going there and people are walking through, you know, forest. So, which is really amazing. When I see, uh, you know, some videos like that, that time I feel, I really feel that place. So that time I think, oh, if, is it possible to give the, go there to visit the, that place? So, and also I'm a, yeah, uh, I'm a, you know, hill area lover. I mean, I'm a mountain lover. So when, whenever I see, any kind of mountains that time I just, you know, feel so interested to, to go there to see the mountains. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So one day, yeah, I if, if I have any chance, then I will try to visit there. I will try to go there. If, is it possible? So, uh, okay. So nice hey, to meet Shama, you again. You're most welcome. Uh, yeah, okay. You're most nice welcome. to meet you again. We have yeah, talked yeah, a lot of things and nice to meet you too. And thank you. I, I just want to uh, thank you once again for inviting me here. Okay. And this is my pleasure that I'm talking to you because mm -hmm. you are quite famous uh, on social media nowadays. And mm -hmm. many people, they just wish to talk to you.